you know, you can make your own piping on your serger. All you need is to be able to switch your regular serger foot for a cording foot. So if your machine has a cording foot available, you can make your own piping. So I've only used, get this focused here, three threads. I took out the left needle and the left thread. When you're making piping, you don't want that line of stitching to be too close because it will possibly show when you put it into your project. Also, this cording should really be able to pull through the piping. But my cord, I've got my presser foot up and I'm gonna slide it under here so it's in that groove. I can see the groove on the front. And then I've got my length of fabric that I need to use. And you just wrap it around. So it's gonna be trimmed as it is stitched. Of course, because this is surgery. I want to make sure this is wrapped around my cording pretty well, but I'm going to take a few stitches until my fabric is up underneath the foot. Alright, now all I have to do is I sew, make sure the cording is going to stay in the fold, and it's going to run straight under that foot, and it needs to be tight on the cording and then I'm going to stop periodically and make sure it stays tight and then I'm just going to keep on sewing. Get to the end. I have my extra piping. I just pull it over to the left and it'll just come out like that. Now I have a beautiful length of piping for my project.